In this video, I will show you how to upgrade your current operating system to macOS 15 without any data loss. Hello friends and welcome back to MZ Learning. Friends, macOS 15 also known as macOS Sequoia is Apple new operating system for their Apple computers. It was introduced today at WWDC and is currently in the developer beta version. So this means it might have some bugs. But if you can't wait like me to test its new feature without waiting for the final version, then I highly recommend you install it on a separate partition. I made a separate video on this topic. If you are interested, the link is in the video description. However, if you have a separate Mac or simply want to upgrade your current operating system to macOS 15, then the procedure is very simple. And here is how to do it. Friends, before starting the procedure, you will need to take care of a few things to ensure a successful upgrade. The first thing you need to do is check your Mac compatibility with macOS 15. Like other operating systems, macOS 15 has some hardware limitations, so not every Mac can run it. For your convenience, in the video description, I have provided a list of computers that are compatible with macOS 15. If your computer is on the list, then feel free to proceed to step number 2. In step 2, check and ensure you have enough storage space on your Mac for the upgrade. To successfully upgrade to macOS 15, your Mac needs 30 to 35 GB of free hard drive space. However, having more free space such as 50 GB or higher will result in a smoother macOS 15 experience. The third step is to backup your Mac. It's very important to backup your Mac before installing any major software updates. This way, if something goes wrong during the upgrade, you can restore your data from your backup. You can backup your Mac using Time Machine or any other backup method. It's always a good idea to create a bootable USB drive for your current operating system if you don't have a bootable backup. Once you have checked your Mac compatibility, storage space and backed up your data, you can proceed to download and upgrade to macOS 15 developer beta. The procedure is very simple. Go to your system settings, click on journal and then click on software update. Here you will see an option beta updates. If you don't see the option for beta updates, it means your Apple ID is not associated with the Apple beta program. You will need to join the program first and it's very easy. All you need to do is open your web browser and visit the Apple developer website. Here sign in with your Apple ID. And that's it. Now you can download the macOS 15 developer beta. Close the web browser and once again open your system settings. Click on journal and then software update. Here you will see a new option beta updates. Click on the small eye icon next to beta updates. Now click on the beta updates drop down menu and choose macOS 15 developer beta. Then click on the done button. Wait a few seconds and you will see macOS 15 available for upgrade. Click on the upgrade now button. The upgrade process will start. This is the first step of macOS 15 installation. In this step, first the system will download macOS 15 updates and then it will prepare our system for upgrade. After that, our system will need to restart. This whole process will take some time depend on your internet and hardware configuration anyway after the restart the second and final installation process will begin this process will take some time depending on your hardware configuration during this process your system may restart several times it's normal so please don't worry the entire process is automatic so there is no need to do anything just sit back and let it complete. After few minutes, 
you will see that your Mac is upgraded to macOS 15. So friends, thus you can upgrade your current operating system to macOS 15. As soon as macOS 15 is installed, I will make a video of its new features and tips and tricks. So please keep in touch and subscribe to that channel. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.